video. Hope you guys are doing well. I'm going to start off this reading with um, the messages and then I will get into the tarot. Spirit, what are the messages for Leo? In the pre-shovel, I got family changes. So it could be some changes um, in the household, something like that. We do have keep the faith and support, self-care here as well. I feel like um, that one's important also. Um, but do know you have support in a situation. We do have self-employment here as well. For some of you, you could be getting into that, getting into starting your own business uh, or something like that. Spirit, what is a love message for Leo? Okay. Attraction. You attract love by enjoying this moment fully. A lot more. There could be someone very attracted to you at this time or you find yourself being attracted to somebody at this time. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Okay. So think of a question, Leo. These are just simple uh, angel answer questions. Or answers, I guess, not questions. So what is the answer to Leo's question? feel like I should take all these. Listen to your intuition. No need to worry. Then we have ask for help from others and ask your angels. For those of you interested in a personal reading, you can visit my website at swordstarot.com. There's different reading options for you to choose from. Also go check out the merch at swordstarotmerch.com. A couple of my favorites are the hoodies and the mug. I think everything on there is super, super cute, so go check it out. Also don't forget about my lashes at jayslashes.com for you girlies. Do go check it out also on Instagram as well. Also do be sure to go check out my vlog channel over there. Just share a little bit more of my personal life. And now let's get back into the video. what are the messages for leo justice okay balance five of cups okay so justice this can be getting answers getting the truth about something um the five of cups is being disappointed so maybe you are disappointed about some information that you found out for some of you it could be about a legal situation with justice Ooh, and for some of you you found out your intuition was right uh, the High Priestess here. Pisces energy, also Libra as well. Mm, yeah, something confirmed or something will confirm that your intuition is right. The Ten of Wands. It may clarify why something has been so difficult with a lover. For some of you, you may be dealing with the Gemini. We have the Magician and the Lovers at the bottom of the deck here. Page of Pentacles, the Five of Pentacles. Hmm. You've learned something here with the Page of Pentacles. Um, you may abandon a situation here with the Five of Pentacles. You got a lot of fives. Keep me seeing a five, five, five around. You maybe, yeah, for some of you, you've already have abandoned the situation. For some of you, you're thinking about it. But you have the Page of Cups, the Star, and Judgment. So there may be another option here. The Page of Cups, this could be somebody new. Um, immediately, I just felt flirting. Maybe you're flirting with someone new here. It could be an Aquarius with the Star card, the Judgment card. So maybe you're still not so sure how you feel about this person. I mean, with the Page of Cups, I feel like you definitely like them, or this person definitely likes you. The Judgment is here for a reason. We'll figure out uh, why when I clarify. Why is Justice here? Why is justice here for Leo? Four of Cups. Yeah, you are not happy with what you found out. Uh, some of you could be dealing with the Aries with the Emperor card here. Um, this is being... I feel like you're just getting a little over the connection, kind of bored of the connection. It's like you're disappointed, but I almost feel like you're not surprised as well, whatever this information is. Okay. Clarifying the Five of Cups, we have the Six of Pentacles and the Two of Cups. So you could be mad that you've given so much to this person, whether it's emotionally, money-wise, um, physically, whatever it is. I feel like you were trying to do your part. Maybe you felt like they weren't doing theirs in this connection. Or you feel like they're not doing theirs if you guys are still 
uh, together. Clarifying the high priestess, we have the hierophant. Okay, I'm getting a couple messages with this. Um, you may have found out that someone was married. So give me more on the hierophant energy. Mm. Stuck in a marriage or still. Hmm. Somebody is getting attention elsewhere. Could be at work, coworker type of energy. I feel like you intuitively know this. And this is why you want to abandon the situation. We have the Five of Pentacles here twice. Yeah, for some of you, you're done with this. Why is the Ten of Wands here? I feel like dealing with this situation has been very overwhelming. There's not that many Pentacles here, so I feel like we're having, or this is a love reading. King of Pentacles. For some of you, it could be an Earth sign to us with a Capricorn. Is the page of pentacles energy here the eight of swords yeah i definitely feel for some of you you've been dealing with this for a while i feel like this has been a cycle maybe you feel like you're stuck in the situation um maybe there's things intertwined house kids whatever um but i feel like you are going to essentially free yourself from this situation you're learning something here at the Page of Pentacles. Could just be the lesson you're supposed to learn from dealing with this um, experience. Any more on the Page of Pentacles. The Hanged Man with the Hermit. Yeah, Spirit is wanting you to see something from a different perspective. These two cards uh, together like this, listen to your intuition. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? Now, this may have already gone down or will go down. Yeah, clarifying the Five of Pentacles, we have the Nine of Swords. Somebody is guilty as hell of something. Possibly giving to another situation. Lying. Seven of Swords. Somebody could be lying about money as well. Possibly child support with the Empress card. Hmm. Why is the Nine of Swords here with the Ace of Pentacles? Yeah, child support. Page of Swords. Somebody is lying about some money. Why is the Page of Cups energy here? Ace of Swords. Okay. So on a lighter note, I feel like these cards are completely something else. Somebody is going to express how they feel for you. I feel like this is somebody new, or this could be a message for a different group of Leos. Um, you're going to realize that somebody does like you. Like the Page of Cups makes you feel like somebody has a crush on you. Okay. Maybe more on the Ace of Swords. Ten of Pentacles. Okay, this person could want to grow something with you. Maybe this person is very abundant. Page of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles here again. So this is a new opportunity. Some of you, it's a water sign. Kids, Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah, Ace of Cups. Somebody wants to offer their love to you. There's a star card here, the death card. Wow, this is going to be a big change for you. And I do feel like with the death card here... The star is your hopes and your wishes. With the death card, this means something has to change or you need to let go of something in order to have this star energy. Uh, manifesting what it is that you want. Healing. Could be an Aquarius. The Page of Swords here. Or the Queen of Swords. Why is the Judgment card energy here? So yeah, there's a decision to be made with the Judgment card. With Judgments here, this is a final decision. The Two of Swords. Yeah, you're not sure what to do. But like a part of you wants to see if things can work out and another part of you wants to uh, walk away. Spirit, what is the overall advice for Leo? The Eight of Cups is the saying, walk away. The Five of Swords is just going to be conflict. So I do hope that this reading was helpful for you, Leo. If you would like a personal reading, you can visit my website at swordstarot.com. And I'll see you guys in the next video.